Hello guys, this is Abner from What Studios and this is my mate Joshua Sedaris. So we are here because uh, we are gonna start the process of renovation of our studio, uh, especially our control room. We are waiting on a uh, Audion 8024HE 24 channels board that is gonna be amazing. Big board, big analog board with amazing preamps and we are gonna do um, some improvements in the acoustics. We had an acoustic engineer to come here and do some evaluation of the space and he recommended a lot of stuff. Today we are moving out everything from the control room because um, tomorrow we have people like changing the floor. We are looking forward to the final product like a, a great control room uh, for mixing, mastering and for creating work for, for the kingdom. The Bible says that all the earth is gonna be filled with the glory of God um, and that's what we wanna do with music here so we are looking forward to it and we are ready to crack on. Stay tuned. Yeah. Guys, we are almost. Um, oh, is our girlfriend? Yeah. <laughs> you like Chicky Charme? Yes. Chicky Fly Rock? You take a mickey on me? I, I know Chucky Char. He kick your ass. This is what we do <laughs> with you. Okay, almost is gone. Um, this desk is going out because we are getting the big board. And the Audion um, 8024, it has like a space you know that you can put stuff around you can put a keyboard you can put some so this is going out and the good thing is that we are gonna flip this so this was our audio workstation and everything is gonna be on that side guys so if, as you can see everything's pretty much cleared out we just got the two tables out everything's out in the different rooms we've got sofas outside uh, so we're just clearing up little small things here and there and we're gonna get ready to go so stay tuned It's here! Audient 8024HE 24 channels with DLC um, control layer and the iron um, mix box. Now the challenge is how are we gonna put this on the studio? The floor is done, the video um, production side is, is almost installed. Um, we just need to put this in um, and call some of the guys, you know. We need at least like six people to carry this. It's 600 pounds. So heavy lifting coming up.
Yeah, so this is it. We just brought the console in. It was tricky. If you're ever looking at getting a console anywhere near as big as this one, you need all hands on deck. You can't really get big dollies, trolleys, forklifts through doorways like this. You've got to pick it up with your hands. We had five of us. And even then our hands were slipping because it's sunny out there. We were kind of sweating a little. But it's in. There it is. And I'm so glad there's no knocks. There's no defects. Yep. Good job. Now it's time to assemble the stand. And one last lift onto the stand. And the next is our man Abner, our chief engineer, is going to rig everything up. Watch this space. <laughs> okay guys we are done screwing the legs of the desk and measuring everything the speakers calibrating the distance between the listening position each speaker and the screen and the board uh, we already wired the power on the board right now we are gonna wire all the tie lines um, all the Q lines and the complete system with the Hackintosh and everything else yeah, looking forward to it. it works. Yeah, we should. The moment of truth. Oh my we have lift off Major Tom. Oh, sweet. Oh, yeah. I like all these little lights here. It looks like a spaceship. Woo! Hello guys, um, we are almost done with the setup. Just waiting on a couple of cables that we need for complete, completing our connection from the tie lines to the board. Right now, I just installed our personal monitoring systems. Uh, we are gonna use the Behringer P16 uh, series. So right now I'm here doing the Cat5 cable just to test uh, each of these units and each of these ports, that's very important for us because sometimes one of the uh, Ethernet ports doesn't work and then you don't have power on these units. I'm doing that right now in the meantime we get those cables and later when we get the cables we are gonna complete the, com the whole setup for the studio. It's done! It's done! Finally, we wired up the board and it's incredible. We are testing right now, mixing some stuff from the new album of Dr. James right here. Um, what do you think? I think it's awesome. The sound, the clarity, the sonics is just 500% better than what we had before. Uh, this is a high-end setup at what studios, under the what label, what music group. And it's just, we haven't even finished. We still got the, yeah. um, the acoustic panels to go up on the ceiling, monster panels, seven inch thick, and to clad the rest of the walls. But so far, 
so good and we're gonna give you a little teaser too we have to wait around like seven to seven to six weeks from GIK Acoustics to send us all uh, the treatment that we already ordered um, and when we complete the room it's gonna be even better so much better but right now it's good start amazing start if you want to listen to a little preview and it's not the finished you know mix but we're in the process of mixing down one of the songs from my album that's coming out later later this summer uh, stay tuned uh, it's going to go everywhere on all the dsps through our distributor and uh, this is one of the tracks uh, it's called breathe and it's really the theme is about breathing in the holy spirit of jesus breathing in his wind that he's blowing on us. When we call upon the name of the Lord Jesus, the Bible says we shall be saved. And when we do that, we begin to breathe in the Holy Spirit from heaven that is only flowing down from Jesus. No one else, no other name can save only Jesus. And yeah. that's our vision for the label, isn't it? Adam? Yeah, it is. It is. We want to bring people to Jesus. And we want to spread the gospel through music. Yeah, and very good music coming. I'm with you, oh, oh.